Okay, what is going on, my team? Welcome back to the channel. We're going to keep today's video nice and short and sharp. Before we get started, I do want to draw your attention to the pinned comment down below. Go ahead and click the link. You'll get access to our free Telegram channel where we post daily trade signals, updates, market analysis, and a whole range of other information. If you're interested in trading signals, however, you do have to join our VIP channel. You can contact me directly right through the free channel to get access to that. Let's go ahead and talk about the recent price action was Bitcoin is breaking down. And we've had this short-term payment formation kind of developing over the last... 48 hours and recently just within the last five minutes bitcoin has broken down to the downside we've also lost a pretty major level which is 21,420, and we're currently heading lower the next target in my opinion we down over here at this small increase in volume at around twenty-one thousand dollars. if we lose that level we can come downwards to about 22 uh 20,200 to twenty thousand dollars as a lower target now on the upside, guys, we do have this large POC level over here. You can see this increase in volume and a massive gap in the market heading back upwards to 22,700. There's a possibility that if we do fake out here, reclaim that level, we can push upwards, but it's looking likely that we're going to continue downwards. Let's take a look at the Brave New Coin Liquid Index. And obviously, some big stuff is happening over here, having a bounce up to the 200 day moving average and rejecting. We haven't quite touched it, but we got incredibly close on the weekly. And of course, the 200 day moving average is acting as that major tipping point now, that major trigger and reversal point for the market. Getting back over the 200 will suggest that we're having this bullish momentum and we can push upwards to higher prices, potentially coming back upwards through this dotted trend line, this major dynamic. Uh, diagonal resistance zone and pushing up to $28,000, which would indicate that next major horizontal resistance, which formed the bottom, the basis of uh, that May 2022 uh, support resistance zone. So on the daily, the candles aren't looking too good. We've printed two doji candles in a row, and obviously doji candles are more or less neutral patterns that do suggest you know a reversal or weakening in strength of the trend if you print doji candles after you've had this significant uptrend rally which we've seen here uh, it generally indicates there's been a massive shift between buying and selling and the, the trend has weakened significantly and that's what we're seeing here suggesting that we're seeing a reversal incoming and this reversal will potentially take us back down to the symmetrical triangle formation um, this uptrending line, however, does need a hold. We've talked about in the last few days about how this major resistance zone is the area we do need to break above for us to get short-term bullish. And that if we do, you know, get above here, we can expect to move upwards, you know, $28,000, retesting this downward trend line, $27,900. But if we don't, we do expect another potential low before the bottom is actually in. And this is sitting around a low of $16,500 to $17,000. So there's a lot of information coming out in the next few days. Obviously, we have the Feds, uh, you know, coming together. You've got the CPI numbers. And obviously, the CPI numbers, if they are worse than expected, we will see the market, um, you know, see the effects of that. The market will drop a little bit. We'll see Bitcoin prices fall, cryptocurrency prices fall, and we could potentially see uh, one more scoop below before we head back up. That's what I think is going to happen. I think it's quite unlikely that we, uh, considering the last two days, two doji candles, it's pretty unlikely that we, we flip around here and turn green and head upwards. If we do, we would need a break above around $22,000 to see that move upwards to about twenty eight. But I think the more likely scenario on a short term, guys, is that we head down lower, potentially hitting down to around low to mid 20,000s and even lower if we break this trend line. Okay. Just a quick update from me. I hope everyone has a great day. Um, I'll be back tomorrow with a more extended update. Um, in the meantime, go ahead and check out the video for BitGet. And obviously, if you're interested in becoming a trader, learning how to trade and do TA, the uh, course is there for you. Okay, we'll catch you in tomorrow's video. Okay, guys, we're going to be taking a quick look at BitGet. And now BitGet is where I personally trade. I highly recommend signing up to BitGet with the link down below. BitGet is probably the best exchange out there if you are a trader. It has a variety of features and the best things about BitGet are a few things. Number one, it's non-KYC. Well, KYC is completely optional on BitGet. Now, there's a whole variety of exchanges out there nowadays that have gone completely centralized, sharing your personal trading information and information of decentralized uh, governments and different governing bodies. BitGet allows that option to be left to the individual, to the user of the exchange. You can decide to non-KYC, you can decide to KYC. It's completely your choice. Another really beneficial thing about BitGet and the biggest reasons why I, I'm sitting here actually recommending BitGet to all my, all my followers is that it has 0.02% trading fees, all right? This is significantly lower than any other cryptocurrency trading exchange out there, FTX, Binance, 
to name a bunch more, KuCoin, it is significantly lower, by 500% lower than the lowest exchange out there, Binance. Um, another big thing, guys, is there's no global restrictions on who can use BitGet. Anyone from anywhere can sign up to BitGet and get access to the entire exchange of all the tools, whether it be futures or spot. No matter which country you're in, you can use futures and spot. If you're in America, for say, and you want to get access to more spot trading pairs, such as Binance Global, and you can't sign up, well, guess what? They've got 250 different spot trading pairs here on BitGet to get access to, and you can get access to all of these. If you're in Australia and you want to access the futures market and you can't trade futures, you can do it here on BitGet. You can get access to the future market and start trading with leverage. And finally, guys, if you do want to sign up to BitGet, go ahead, click that link down below to sign up to BitGet and you'll get access to the reward center over here, which enables up to $4,000 in rewards by completing five tasks. All right, guys, we'll get back to the video. Thanks for listening to that. Okay, guys, I want to take a quick moment to introduce the Become a Trader course at the end of this video. This course was designed by myself and Wolves of Crypto. We put together a whole variety of knowledge to create the most cohesive, understandable, and beneficial trading course there is on the market. If you're interested in learning how to become a trader, if you're interested in learning how to use technical analysis, if you're interested in learning how to apply market analysis to different cryptocurrencies, this is a course for you. We teach you everything from the fundamentals, the basics about what cryptocurrency is, how to trade cryptocurrency, mastering the craft of cryptocurrency, diving into a whole range of technical indicators, market structures, and teaching you how to utilize these when finding trades and applying risk management strategies to become more profitable over time. We even dive into market psychology, human psychology, and provide a variety of different videos and educational content, including courses and quizzes to assist your learning along the way. If this is something you're interested in, guys, go ahead and contact us down below at the Crypto Academy courses at gmail.com. We'll send you an email back with all the course information, the structure, the payment details, and everything else you need to know. That being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video today, and we'll catch you in the next one.